Under a new policy, anytime you go to the airport to fly overseas, the federal government will biometrically scan your face before you can board. Congress never gave permission to scan Americans' faces, but Homeland Security is doing it anyway. Also troubling, Homeland Security hasn't issued a single rule to protect the privacy of travelers when their face is scanned. Although the federal government may spend up to $1 billion to scan every traveler's face, it hasn't clearly explained why. It's a solution in search of a problem. Even if a problem could be identified, the federal government doesn't appear to know if its face scanning system can detect someone flying under a false identity. This system could lead to as many as one in 25 legitimate travelers being pulled from the boarding line and fingerprinted. That could lead to delayed flights and disrupted travel for everyone. From the perspective of Americans who value their privacy and just want to fly without being subjected to another pointless piece of security theater, this billion dollar boondoggle is not ready for takeoff.